Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are filming another one of my favorite videos and that is a self tanning review. So Ballybody just launched a new product. You guys know Ballybody is like one of my favorite self tanning brands, if not the number one. And they just came out with a clear self tanning mousse. This is a totally new product, a totally new formula and I put it to the test last night and I have a lot of things that I wanna share with you. So without further ado, let's jump right into this video. So some information about this new product. This is Bally Body's new water-based full tanning solution. It's a transparent water to foam formula with no dyes, no parabens, and no other nasty ingredients. It's enriched with nourishing oils, skin loving ingredients, and a rich source of antioxidants for a perfect tan that smooths, tightens, and hydrates while giving you a natural glow. So this is formulated with 100% natural, DHA and environmentally friendly ingredients. So it's really great for sensitive skin or anyone who's looking for a really natural alternative to self tanning products that they want to incorporate into their beauty routine. So it's a water based solution. Again, no dyes, no parabens, no sulfates, and no color transfer. That is key. Made with 99% naturally derived glucose and it's vegan and cruelty free. So that's always a bonus. I wanted to know a few of the key ingredients. We have aqua coffee seed extract, coconut oil, pomegranate extract, and chamomile extract. So a really interesting combination. So a couple more things about this before I show you the demo, the application, and all that. This says it's the cleanest, easiest way to achieve a perfect fake tan. The clear mousse develops a light, natural looking, and streak-free tan over two to six hours. So I really like the time frame there. You could use this for two hours, or you could use this for six. It can be a faster developing formula or a longer option, depending on what you prefer. I tested it over a longer period of time, so you will see my results for like over an eight hour wear, but I would be curious to put it to the test for like a two or three. The transparent formula ensures zero transfer onto your bed sheets or clothing. It's enriched with nourishing oils for smooth, hydrated, bronzed skin. So that is a little bit about the product itself. Um, they sent it over with one of their Lux tanning mitts. I really love these mitts. Honestly, combine a mousse or a foam with a mitt and you will get the most perfect, even streak-free tan every single time. This is like the secret weapon right here. So yeah, that's all I use to apply it and I'm just going to walk you through that process right now. So I'm going to rewind to last night, show you how I applied it, what it looked like when I woke up this morning, and then I'm going to come back at the end and kind of give you my pros and cons and overall thoughts about the new self-tanning water. All right, you guys are getting a raw, unfiltered look right now. I've had a pretty rough skin week, so I'm dealing with a couple of monsters on my face. But as you can tell, I am blinding white. I'm trying to give you a good visual here. So this is the Bally Body Clear Self Tanning Mousse. To apply it today, I'm going to use the Lux Tanning Mitt. The Lux Tanning Mitt is the ultimate self tanning tool. It ensures a streak free and smooth application of your Bally Body Self Tan, keeping your hands stain free while providing a flawless glow. All right, so I'm going to grab the self tanning mousse. Um, this is in the shade light and on the back it says it's the cleanest easiest way to achieve the perfect fake tan this clear mousse develops a light natural looking and streak free tan over two to six hours the transparent formula ensures zero transfer onto bed sheets or clothing enriched with nourishing oils for smooth hydrated and bronzed skin so I'm gonna put the luxe mitt on my hand and oh my gosh this is honestly the softest smoothest silkiest mitt it feels so good on the skin I'm gonna shake up the bottle really well and apply it to the mitt. So a generous amount into my palm and then I'm going to rub it into my skin. Now again, this is clear so it does not have any pigment to it. It is not guided so you really have to go based on how you feel. Um, if there's any dry or bare spots, you wanna do your best to cover them. The mitt really does help in this situation though. So I'm gonna to try to get my neck and my chest and my back as best as I can. This part can be kind of tricky if you're doing it on your own, but luckily we're still kind of in the middle of winter, so all of our skin is not totally exposed just yet. So if you do happen to have a streak or two, it's not the end of the world. Bringing the camera down a little bit so you can kind of see me get it on the legs. And those blinding white shins. Come on, Bally Body, give me a glow. But again, really easy to apply. The mitt makes this job pretty effortless. What I like about this formula is that it's very, very light. It doesn't feel sticky. It really doesn't have a smell. And it goes on super smooth. A lot of times after I apply a self-tan, I'll feel kind of sticky. I did not experience that with this application whatsoever. Okay, now the face. I always apply with the mitt. I just think it's the quickest, easiest way. You can tell how pale I am holy cow and those pimples are not my best look but got to give you the real view right here the pimple on my cheek I've actually had since the Super Bowl there's nothing left in it it's just like a little bump that needs to heal down the neck around the back get in the ears there you go girl once it's all rubbed in put on your loose fitting clothes this is my overnight outfit just the most attractive pajamas I own. 
and I am going to go to sleep and I'll see you guys first thing in the morning. All right, there's that sleepy girl. So, so sleepy. I literally came to the camera first thing in the morning. So I put the outfit back on so you could kind of see how the tan developed. And as you can see here, I'm definitely looking a little darker than I was when I went to bed. Not as dark as I thought I would be, but a pretty natural, healthy looking glow. So let me back up a little bit here. And you can see my arms and legs. I'm gonna try to do a side by side so you can really get a good visual all the way around. Now I know it's hard to tell because the lighting is so different in the morning versus at night, but my skin definitely has a nice little bronze to it. I'm very, very happy. Here's another look at the legs. I was so impressed with the legs because a lot of times in my hair follicles, it'll get really dark when I apply self tan, but not with this. It's super, super smooth application. Definitely an interesting first experience. Not really what I was expecting at all, but I'm kind of happy with the results. So I made a list of my pros and my cons. Let's start with the negative so we can end on a high note. All right, the first con, and this really isn't a fault of the product. Bally Body did send this to me um, and I did not select a color. So they sent me the light version. And anytime I order a self tanning product, I always get at least a medium, but usually a dark or ultra dark, just because I like that deep, deep color. So I didn't really get a very deep tan, which is fine. I got a very healthy healthy, natural glow, which is kind of what I needed. I just needed something to take the edge off. You could tell I was very, very pale before applying it, and it gave me just the right amount of color. When I woke up, I was expecting to look really dark, I guess because I just normally wake up really dark when I tan, but the results were much more natural than I was expecting. So depending on how you look at it, it could be a pro, it could be a con. I just listed it as a con because I was expecting something a little darker. Um, again, I would just attribute it to the shade. Another con, and this is more of a personal preference, since it is a clear formula, there is no guided application. So you're you're kind of applying it blindly. You have to go by how you feel. So when you use the mitt, of course that helps you get an even and streak-free application, but you do kind of have to feel for the areas that are still dry to make sure that you don't miss any spots. I would consider myself a self-tanning professional, though I'm kind of good at this at this point, but if you need a little more guidance or you're not that great at applying evenly, you may prefer one of their products that does have a pigment to it so you can see where you are applying. Like I mentioned earlier, it says that this product develops over two to six hours, um, and obviously the longer you leave a product on, the deeper it's going to become. Also, they recommend applying a second coat 30 minutes after your initial application if you want a deeper tan, and while that's a great option, I'm more of a one-stop shop kind of girl. I just wanna get the deepest tan I can in one shot. So for me, that's a bit of a turnoff. However, this is again the light formula. So with a darker shade, that's probably not a necessary step, but that's all I had on my con list. I think there's definitely way more pros. So we're gonna go through those now. First pro, like I mentioned earlier, it's a pretty fast developing formula. You can use it between two and six hours. You have the potential to get a tan after two hours or after six or longer. Bally Body did release their express formula last month, so that is like a true one hour formula, which I would recommend if you're looking for a faster developing time, but it's nice that this one doesn't need to be left on completely overnight to work. I am crediting the formula as a pro. I like the option of having a clear mousse or foam to work with. While I do like using the pigmented formulas, I find that they're very helpful when applying. Something about the clear formulas is just a nice option to have. Sometimes I'm not in the mood for that mess and you know that the darker formulas usually do transfer. So working with the clear formula is just overall a cleaner experience. And to piggyback off of that, it says right on the bottle, zero transfer. It says it on the back, it says it on the website, and this is 100,000 billion percent a zero transfer product. I did not get a stitch of self tanning on my sheets, on my pillowcase, on my pajamas, on my towel, nowhere. No transfer whatsoever. So that is a huge, huge pro. In terms of application, I found it to be very seamless. It was even, it was streak free. Again, you combine any kind of mousse or foam formula with a mitt and you are going to get excellent, excellent results. So I was very pleased with that. And then the final pro that I have, it's the biggest one. I'm actually shocked to be saying this because I don't think I've ever claimed this for any self tanning product ever, ever, ever before in my life. This was odorless. I could not smell it. I could not smell it whatsoever. When I was applying it, I didn't smell it. While I was sleeping, I didn't smell it. When I woke up in the morning, I didn't smell it. When I took a shower, I didn't smell it. After I took a shower, I didn't smell it. And right now, I still don't smell it. This is odorless. I don't even know if they claim that it's odorless or maybe I have a bit of a stuffy nose or something, but I do not smell this. And to me, that is like, huge, 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 like breaking news. Hello, I found an odorless option. So I love that about this product. So that was it for my pro and con list. Overall, 
it's a great option. It takes the edge off, and I think this time of year, that's all we're really looking for. We want a little bit of a sun-kissed glow just to take away some of that like bright, bitter, white skin that we develop in like January, February, March, where we're like praying for spring. We are all so ready for warmer weather, but we're getting there, guys. We're really, really close. But if you're a little impatient, you can't wait, definitely give this a shot. So that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and thank you to Bally Body for sending this over and sponsoring this video. I love getting the opportunity to try these tanners and share them with you. Please give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already done so, and I will see you guys in my next one. Ow!